and killed by a driver who took off. It's grief that's been ignited as a memorial to Gloria San Miguel reflects the mood of an entire community. It just seems unimaginable, but it has happened. But the depth of the greatest loss is yet to be measured. My loss is great and everybody's is, but the daughter's loss is going to be by far the worst. Cassie San Miguel is Gloria's mother. She says as difficult as it is to comprehend, the impact of the death hasn't fully reached its most vulnerable victim, Gloria's daughter, Luna. The biggest loss, I guess, of all of us is going to be that the three-year-old daughter right now that don't even understand what's going on. We've obtained this security video. It clearly shows two well-lit bikes crossing the 11th Street Bridge at about 1224 a.m. Saturday. Gloria was riding with her daughter's father. The bikes are seen disappearing just before the collision. A vehicle, possibly a dark-colored SUV, rounds the corner and appears to be the closest vehicle at the time of the collision. An audible noise can be heard at the time it reaches the bikes all caught on camera. But the striking vehicle took off. Now an effort to enhance the pictures. Lifeboat video has worked to make the video more clear. Here's an enhanced picture. But there may be more ways to track the driver. A lot of times the forensics, they'll find a piece of some plastic on the ground. They can trace it back to a make or model or year of a vehicle. As friends and family share their concern and their grief together. It does help to know that other people loved and cared for as much as we do. Yeah, so there are a lot of other potential ways. We're talking about witnesses, possibly pieces of the vehicle uh, left behind, but we're yet to hear anything from Newport Police at this point. Reporting live, Brian Hemrick, WLWT News 5. Hey, Brian, anything else we can learn from that video you're showing us? We know that uh, Lifeboat Digital Media, they're still working for us to try and uh, enhance that video some more. It does take time for that all to render. But there are some other things like this. We know this vehicle is traveling uh, from Covington into or from Newport into Covington. They were coming that way at that time of night. There's a good chance because pretty much most of the people that use this bridge are local. There's a good chance that person lives in Covington. Mike. All right, Brian Hamrick live for us tonight. Brian, thanks so much. Meanwhile, tonight it's the news. Who day name?